to the film boundary uh, because I think uh, most of you who are with uh, international college, uh, 3D Phnom Penh International College, probably not uh, sort of uh, keen with uh, what's going on between Thailand and Cambodia. So we like to give you uh, a background and uh, after that uh, we will show the film and then we will have discussion, uh, a talk with the uh, young director, Kun Nontawat. Please stand up. <laughs> this is the director and producer. <laughs> Okay. Uh, let's go. Background for boundary Cambodia, Phnom Penh versus Thailand, Bangkok. The question of the Priyat Vihya, Pratvihan, Temple, and a clash of two nationalism. 50 years ago, in 1962, the World Court ICJ ruled by the vote of 9 to 3 that. The temple belongs to Cambodia. It was a shock and a humiliation to us in Thailand. Ten years ago, 2003, the Thai embassy in Phnom Penh, uh, Cambodia was torched and burned down. This is a, a Thai movie star who was supposed to say that she would not visit Cambodia unless the temple of Angkor Wat uh, is returned to Thailand. I don't believe she said that kind of thing, but this is what happened to the Thai embassy in Phnom Penh. Seven years ago, in September 2006, there was a coup against uh, Prime Minister Thaksin. Uh, this is the... If we have another coup soon, uh, five people like this will come out on TV and why us nicely to tell us that we staged a coup d'etat. Uh, September uh, 2006, 2008, five years ago, the Priyat Vihya Temple was registered as a World Heritage by the UNESCO. Uh, Thailand initially supported the nomination, but because of internal politics, we withdrew the uh, recognition. But the vote went on 21 to 0 for Thailand. The prayer we hear, uh, your Ajahn, Mr. Te, your Akrapong, uh, was up there with me how many years ago? Ten years ago. Okay, the prayer we hear temple is really fantastic. The site. So, uh, from uh, 2008, you know, the our uh, two countries have been turned into a battlefield rather than a marketplace. From peace to war, this is along the border. Tanks, uh, village uh, houses burning yeah, along the, the border. This is February 2011. It was a joy in Cambodia that they won the registration with the UNESCO. The Khmer have been very united. But in Thailand, this is along the border, uh, uh, red versus yellow. And if you follow the news now, uh, if you read from the nation of the Bangkok Post, you will hear that there is there are some uh, protests along the border right now. This is what happened in 2008. Uh, the country is divided into yellow, uh, taking over the Nongu Hau or Suwanapum Airport. Uh, the red, you know, you can see that they are carrying Thai flags. Uh, the problem now is with this uh, so-called overlapping uh, disputed uh, area of 4.6 square kilometers, rather small, rather small, okay? So, uh, conclusion is that Thai domestic politics, uh, yellow shirt versus the red one, spill over into Cambodia, uh, demise of two male premier. Uh, Abhisit became 
another male prime minister, the two male premier who was uh, uh, kicked out, who were kicked out. Abhisit became prime minister. It's a clash of two nationalism between Thailand and Cambodia. But two years ago, July 3rd, something rather unusual happened. There was an election, and this uh, good-looking woman became the first female prime minister. She's rather unusual, you know, because she's rather uh, good-looking compared to her brother and sister. And uh, she's rather unusual because she doesn't talk much compared to male politicians in Thailand. So, uh, 15 days after the election, after uh, Ying Lak became uh, Prime Minister, the uh, ICJ, the World Court in The Hague, declared an area of almost 20 square kilometers around the temple as a demilitarized zone. Okay, this is the area, and then Ying Lak uh, visiting uh, Hun Sen in Cambodia, the relation between the two countries uh, much better now. Uh, they even have some kind of uh, friendship football match. Uh, you see that, that Prime Minister Hun Sen, instead of wearing his uh, blue uh, t-shirt, uh, his team color, he wore red. Look at them. So, right now, you know, pending a decision from the ICJ, uh, April 15, you know, which is uh, what? Today, five days from now, between uh, April 15 and 19, uh, there will be a verbal testimony at ICJ in The Hague, the Netherlands, and would be uh, broadcasted in to Thailand with Thai translation plus English subtitle, I guess, because the whole thing will be in French. Uh, and by October, 3rd, uh, October this year, the court will make a decision for the appeal of Cambodia. Cambodia asked the court to do an interpretation of the 1962 verdict that what is the vicinity around the temple? Who owns the, the land around the, the temple? They use the word vicinity. In Thai would be Anake, Anaboriwe. So this is something pending, something that uh, we don't know what will happen, but we hope that, you know, how to uh, turn the uh, area into a, a peace zone and how to make love, not war, with our neighbor. Thank you. ไปแดงตอนแรกก็สั่นกลัวเหมือนกันแต่พอไปอยู่จริงๆก็สบายก็ไม่มีอะไรฝึกหนัก
จก็ฝึกเสร็จก็สบายขึ้นตรงร้อยเสร็จก็สบายโอ้แต่เป็นทหารเดี๋ยวคนทหารนี่เขาชอบตัวแดงนั่นเลยผมเห็นน้องก็ชอบตัวแดงทหารบ้านนอกเลยบ้านนอกอะไรต้องไปปากนี่ไม่แบบว่าเพราะว่าไม่อยากทำหรอกไม่อยากจะไปหรอกทำตามหน้าที่คำสั่งต้องไปมรดกโลกของศูนย์กลางมรดกโลกเพื่อไปถึงองค์การยูเนสโกที่อยู่ในการดูแลของท่านและตัวท่านเองยังได้ให้การสนับสนุนการขึ้นทะเบียนปราส